Hey, hey guys, Will Man Channel, and today we will be doing another story time, and this is Adopt Me Edition. So you guys know that I love Adopt Me a lot, but there are also some like downs in Adopt Me. Like there, are, sometimes can it can be like really annoying. You know the reasons if you're a real Adopt Me player. So um, the first reason is also has something to do with the story which is basically one day when I was in like an Adami server like this really like annoying thing happened. So yeah, so let's go and get started with this video. So basically what happened was that I just like went into the server and I just, I started trading and I was like trading my um, fly ride toucan. And then uh, someone said, oh, I want to offer. And I was like, oh sure, okay. And then they were like, okay, so they pulled out lots of neon writable flyable pets and they were like so much, they were so good and they wanted a neon um, poodle since they had it. And I was like, oh, can I like get the neon poodle? And they were like, sure, they were like super duper nice, extra nice to me. But yeah, but anyways, what happened next was that like, basically they accepted and the 13 seconds came for the final acceptance of the trade, just to make sure, to make up your mind, you know that there's two acceptance, if you guys know what I mean. But anyways, um, yeah, so basically, um, they, like, they accepted the trade, but then they unaccepted the trade. And then I accepted the trade, and then they declined. And I was like, hey, why did you decline? And they were like, oh, accident. And then I decided to trade them again, and then they left the server. And I knew that they didn't on purpose just to, like, troll me or something. Because they obviously was like, were, like, um, flexing on me of their pets. Because they obviously aren't going to trade that. But anyways, yeah, so... That is the first story. There's no more of the story because I literally cannot think right now. But yeah. So anyways, the next story is of this time when I was like trading in Adami and it's like also like a really annoying thing. So I used to be like pretty poor back then. But yeah, so this girl in the server, I had my flat ride bunny, you know, like fluffy ubu, yeah, my bunny. I traded to Caroline. Because I don't own it anymore. Um, I used to have it. It was a fire rideable bunny. And it was like probably my favorite. And this girl in the server was like, oh my god, that's literally my dream pet. Can I please like have it? And then I was like, yeah, sure. You want to offer? And she's like, oh yeah, sure. I'm pretty sure I don't have good offers, but I'll try it. And then um, I was like, oh sure, okay. And then she like offered like um, a stroller. A normal stroller and she also offered a Shiba Inu, Inu or however you pronounce it. Okay, sorry. But anyways, uh, she offered those and I was like, oh, sorry, I really like my buddy. Um, but yeah, I can't like accept the trade. And then she was like, no, please. I really, really want it. It's like literally my DP. Like I wanted it for so long that I could do literally anything for it. And then I was like, no, sorry, I'm not being that type of person, but I really like my bunny. Anyways, yeah. So basically what happened next was that that girl literally got mad and she was like, why don't you trade me? Why don't you just accept the trade? She's like, oh, I hate you rich brats. But I wasn't even rich. That was like the only thing that was like flyable rival. The others in my inventory were all like rivals or normal pets. But yeah, so she was like, I hate you rich people, they are so spoiled. And I'm like, I'm not rich. She's like, yeah, you are, we have a fire rival bunny. I'm like, well, I don't have like a mega or a neon or any like legendary, like those type of pets or out of the game ones that, or the ones that cost really much Robux or something. But yeah, and then she was like, well, you're still rich. So please just trade me the fire rival bunny. And I'm like, no, cause I love this bunny. It was literally my first rival rival. But yeah. So anyways, what happened next was that this girl, she kept on trading me. She, like, she wouldn't stop spamming trade in front of my freaking screen. 
And yeah, so she kept on spamming trade, trade, trade until I got like really mad and I was like, can you stop? Like seriously to the point where I had to tell her to stop. And she was like, no, I want it. You're such a rich brat. I'm not even sure if she was allowed to say that because she would she would have been tagged out, but I don't think she got tagged out. But anyways, I was like, I'm not. I'm not even rich. Like, bro. And then she was like, well, I still want to want my bunny. It's my DP. And I'm like, well, why can't you just work hard for it? It's literally only like a rare pet. Like, you really could do anything for a rare pet. You literally could hatch, like, a ton of those and just make them rival, rival, or just, I don't know, just do something. Anyways, um, I just told her that, and then she was like, well, I can't since I'm poor. And then I was like, no, you're literally not poor. And then she was like, yeah, I am. But anyways, um, she, uh... She got like really mad at me only because I kept on declining her offer and she spammed so much to the point where she couldn't actually spam anymore. I'm not sure if she couldn't, but she just stopped spamming and then she left the server. And yeah, so moral of the story, do not keep on like staying in a server when someone literally like won't stop trading you no matter what but yeah guys that was a moral story and now you can watch me attempt to finish this tower and it's a silent edition so if you want to hear me like talking or anything Bruh.